Spinosaurus. Tyrannosaurus Rex. Since its release, Spinosaurus has been regarded by many as the strongest dinosaur in game. However, with the arrival of T-Rex, can this change? Has the Spinosaurus finally been dethroned? Or is he able to clap T-Rex just like he did in Jurassic Park 3? Who even has the upper hand in the battle? Let's find out. In this video, I, Arden Vokter, will analyze the opponent's weapons, armor and stats to find out who is the true king of Path of Titans. Tyrannosaurus comes in different classes. We got balance, we got plus speed minus defense, we got plus attack minus defense, but for the sake of the video, we are going to go with balance. Same applies to the Spinosaurus. We got balance, we got plus speed minus defense, we got plus defense minus speed. For the sake of this video and for fairness, I would like to use balance type from both dinosaurs. Uh, however, I have not grown a uh, balanced Spinosaurus, I only have speed, so when we're going to do uh, weapons testing, we're going to use speed. Results, Tyrannosaurus Rex got greater stamina and speed. However, remember, Spinosaurus is semi-aquatic. Should this be a race in the water, there is no question on who's gonna come on top. You've probably heard in many documentary, for T-Rex it's all about the bite. The same applies to Path of Titan. The T-Rex abilities is shown on screen. You can pause the video to read the details. You can equip two different bite abilities for the T-Rex. Do also note there is a leg and back limb uh, attack. However, there is no attack for this uh, category yet. So we will have to see what we ha can get in the future. Now then, let's see the arsenal and weapons of the Spinosaurus. Just like the T-Rex, you can choose what abilities you will equip. The Spinosaurus abilities is as following. Do note not all of these abilities are combat related, but they can assist you depending on where the battle should be taking place. You can pause the video for greater detail. Despite seemingly having more abilities than the T-Rex, you can't equip it all. The Spinosaurus arsenal stands of head, front limb, Hide and tail, at least during a fight. Now then, let's see how much damage they can do to each other, starting off with the T-Rex. I'm quite surprised on how little damage I actually took as a Spino, and I'm not even a defensive Spino. To figure out if we actually had the area damage, we aim for my head next.
Out from observation, it doesn't seem like there's area damage. Also, reminder I'm using a speed spino in this test and a balanced T-Rex as damage dealer. Now let's see a spino damage on a T-Rex. I also wanted to note that I got lucky with this test. For this test, we're using a balanced spino and a balanced T-Rex. So this will be roughly fair, hopefully. This test was really surprising. If we put the results side by side, we can see it's pretty, pretty even. Also, just a little tip. It seems like the hitbox is a bit wonky, so don't really use the claws against a T-Rex. So in conclusion, we can't really decide a victor just yet. It all comes down to the player's skill. A battle can have different scenarios. The Spino could lose his stamina on land and be uh, vulnerable to the T-Rex attacks. In the face of just biting, the T-Rex would eventually lose. However, if we think about it this way, neither the T-Rex nor the Spino will ever be the true king of Path of Titans. The Herbivores got something to say about that.